Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2022 Panini Prism Baseball. Six box, half case, random team break number three. One spot gets you two teams. All card ship, a lot of fun stuff here, so let's do it. First of all, let's double up that list right there. Oh, double up. Oh, oh. All 30 teams are in, and let's roll it, randomize it one and a two, three times. One, two, three strikes, you're out in the old ball. Got Nate down to Dave. One and a two, three times for the teams. Two and three. Easy. I like these low number dice rolls late at night, later at night. Ram.org. Keep it up. We got the Brewers down to the Cubs after three. All right. Nathan with the Brewers, Bill with the Rays, Shay, uh, that's Thomas with the Mets, David with the Nationals, Bobby with the Royals, Greg with the Braves, Thomas with the Diamondbacks, Greg with the Pirates, Bobby with the Rangers and the Phillies with your last spot mojo, Mark with the Reds, Greg with the A's, Bill with the Cardinals, Rick T with the Padres, Bobby with the Marlins, Mark with the Astros, Zachary with the Tigers, Rick with the Blue Jays, Bobby with the Angels, the Giants, the Twins and the Red Sox, Adam, you got my Dodgers. Bobby with the Yankees and Orioles, Nate with the Rocks, Greg with the Guardians, Zachary with the Mariners, Adam with the White Sox, and David O with the Chicago Cubbies. Let's alphabetize by team. And uh, feel free to trade. Brewers and Rockies up for trade. If anybody's, and while you're considering trade, I'm going to flip back to the screen in just a second, but let's see which six boxes we're gonna do. So here's the full case of Prism Baseball. We won't have time for it tonight, but we do have a full case break. Pick your team of Prism Baseball in the store right now if you wanna grab your teams. That'll break tomorrow. All right, we got two, four, six on the left side, six on the right side. And as you've seen me do dozens of times, we'll roll the die. One, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. And it's two, one, two, three for the left side. All right, we'll keep the video running. Any offers for Brewers Rockies? We'll give it a few moments. Otherwise, we will just roll. All right, trade window going once. Trade window going twice. TWC trade window closed. Let's print and rip. Now the box says that there's three autos a box, but a lot of the boxes we've seen more than that. We've seen like four. So there may be bonus autos. All right, so big thanks everybody here for making it happen, appreciate it. All right. Good luck.
Now, we were, we were asking this question a little bit earlier today. Maybe there will be there's some more people watching the stream at this moment. Who does everyone have in the playoffs? Let's start with uh, Friday. Friday's four games. on. It's going to be really fun. Wild card weekend. So Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So if necessary. Sunday's a if necessary. Tampa Bay at Cleveland. That's the, uh, for me, that's the morning game, the 9 a.m. game. Who does everyone have in that game? I know, Chad, you, you, you have your Mariners. We'll get to that game in a moment. Who does everyone have at Tampa Bay at Cleveland? Shane, it's the Shanes. Shanes are starting against you. Yeah. Shane McClanahan versus Shane Beaver. We got Rodolfo Castro to 75. I, I'm Lucas and Chad have Tampa Bay. I'm kind of leaning, uh, kind of leaning Cleveland. Well, speaking of Tampa Bay, there's Shane Boz. That goes to Bill in Tampa Bay. Yeah, Nate's taking the Rays as well. McClanahan, absolute beast, says Lucas. Hmm. Yeah, having a top ace in the wild card game, yeah, they, they kinda they kinda got that in a good spot there. There's Mike Trout Lava Flow. I believe that's a short print a short print. I don't see these too often. That'll be for the Halos. That's gonna go to Bobby. And what a season Mike Trout would have had if he had stayed healthy for 162 games. We got Alfonso Rivas for the Cubs to 199. Are those cases? Are they one per case? I thought they were a little more short printed than that, but maybe they do kind of fall one per case. See Yachty the playoffs for the last time. Those lava flows are pretty cool. There could have been a situation. Those red and blue parallels, not numbered, by the way, which is why I'm kind of breezing by them. Um, there could have been a situation, there's Riley Adams, where Trout and Judge would have been chasing 60 down the stretch. Man. Sports media would have would have uh, melted down. Forty two out of seventy five. That would have been incredible. That I don't know if there would have David O with the Nats. I feel like that would have been the same feeling. It's back in the late nineties. It would have been that kind of buzz. There's Luke Williams. Use the false Luke. Giraffe print for the Phillies. That's for Bobby. Another short print there. Uh, that Torkelson, by the way, goes to Zachary and the Tigers. There's a lime green Juan Soto stained glass to 125. The stained glass in this prism baseball is a little more, you can see right there, a little more common. Ooh, and a one of one. Wow. One of one debut signatures autograph, Jorge Mateo Orioles. Bobby Bursky with Baltimore. Nice, and all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Nice way to start things off. David O gets that Juan Soto lime green stained glass. Nice box one. Box two. Gilo hasn't seen very many promotions for this year's playoffs. Come on, MLB. They should be, they should be branding this and marketing this as wild card weekend. Take a page out of the NFL playbook. Market the hell out of that wild card. This is a, these are ESPN games, too. Three of the four games tomorrow are ESPN games. The Philadelphia at St. Louis is the ABC game. That's on the big network. Philadelphia at St. Louis. Who does everyone have there? Yeah, that's not, that would have been a nice personal box, right, Chad Daw? The Lava Flow, the Giraffe, and a one-of-one -one auto.
Zach Wheeler gets a start for Philadelphia. And Jose Quintana gets a start for St. Louis. Two red teams. Who does everyone have? And why? We got debut signatures, Edward Olivares. That's for Kansas City, Bobby with the Royals. Bobby probably looking for some Bobbies. We've got a Cutter Crawford rookie autographs for the Red Sox. Another one for Bobby B. Uh, Philadelphia at St. Louis, Zach Wheeler gets the start for Philadelphia. Jose Quintana on the bump for the uh, for the Cardinals, for the Redbirds. That's the 11.07 a.m. game, for me anyway. It's the second game. There he is, there's, there's Zach Wheeler. Nate says Cardinals. It's a pretty strong team there. That infield is pretty... Uh, Pretty amazing. Goldschmidt and Arenado on the corners. It's not bad. A rejuvenated Albert Pujols. 65 out of 100, Sandy Alcantara. Possibly your NL Cy Young. A red Torkelson for the Tigers. That's going to go to Zach. Cal Raleigh, nice rookie season for Cal Raleigh. A lot of, a lot of dingers for the catcher, 8 out of 25. Some clutch dingers. It's going to be helpful in the playoffs. Zach with Seattle. There's Bobby for Bobby. And there's Colton Welker for the Rocks. For Nate, tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Gilo's thinking the Redbirds, big three, going to go out with a bang. As much as I'd hate to admit it. And we got a Ronzi Contreras Blue Mojo to 199 for uh, Greg and the Pirates. Dylan Coleman, rookie autograph for the Royals for Bobby B. Rookie Silver C.J. Abrams for Rick T. and the Padres. All right, another box in the books. Lucas likes the Phillies. Again, I'll take the better starter, he says. Hey, we, we're getting to the Chad Daw game. Chad Daw, as we all know, big Phillies fan, lives, dies with the Phillies. We join him on that roller coaster ride. Seattle is going to Toronto. That's the third game, the 107 game. Are you back on the West Coast, Chad? Early afternoon game for us. On ESPN, Luis Castillo. This is a good matchup. Luis Castillo on the mound for the Phillies, or for the Phillies, for the, for the Mariners. Uh, and Alec Manoa for the Blue Jays. Yeah. 
Quintana could could get bumped from that game pretty uh, pretty early. Now Chad Dahl obviously on his is gonna say the Mariners. Is it gonna be the Mariners? We've got some pretty good pitching. That Alec Manoa, that's that's a that's a tough matchup. That's a tough game one. There's Rafael Marchand for the Phillies. Bobby, one of his last spot mojo teams. Lucas is on the Blue Jays. Jason Jaspi. Yeah, I think Chad already said Mariners earlier. There's Matt Manning. M at symbol Manning. Tigers, that'll be for Zach. Gary Carter to 100. Now, it would be nice to see guys like Julio Rodriguez. See guys like him just on the on the national stage right here. That's for the Mariners. That'll be for Zach. Chad Doss saying Kalanick walk-off homer. The same Jared Kalanick you said was terrible, that he'd that he'd never make it in the major leagues. And yes, Kellenic's going to walk it off on the road. I, I just assumed you meant the game, the eventual game-winning home run. There's Hoyun Park to 60. It's for the Pirates. Oh, maybe that was about, maybe you were saying that about Kyle Lewis. Maybe that was Kyle Lewis. I don't know, you were pretty down on Kellenic too. Like he had one bad week early in the season and then got sent down or something and you were just all down on him. Drew Ellis to 149. There's Rodolfo Castro. Rookie autographs for the Pittsburgh. It's for Greg. For the Pirates. Ah, it's Kyle Lewis that's done. Got it. Pretty sure you've been down on Kellenic too. You know what, Jason Jaspi? Maybe Chad just doesn't like Kyle's. He hates Kyle Seeger, hates Kyle Lewis. What other Kyle's do you hate, Chad Daw? There's Cody Bellinger. <laughs> That's how I feel about uh, Cody Bellinger, Chad Daw. Down but not out on Bellinger. Just like how Chad Daw feels about Jared Kalanick. Jason Jasper, yeah, yeah, you must not like Kyle Tucker. Jason, wh at what point of the game do you think Chad Dog gives up on the Mariners tomorrow? Second inning? If Alec Manoa has a no-hitter through three innings, you think uh, you think Chad Dog just gives it up? He just gives up. He's just like, Alec Manoa is going to no-hit us. It's going to be embarrassing. The Mariners suck. We're going to embarrass ourselves in the playoffs. Hater? I'm not hating, Chad Da. This is this is on brand for you, Chad. This is this is very on brand for Chad. After the sixth inning, Jason Jaspi says, when the Blue Jays are blowing them out. Bottom of the fourth, says Tanner John. Yeah, I, f I feel like that's kind of on brand. I feel like if there's like, if it's like two innings, 
four or five strikeouts. <laughs> and you'll be like, that's it. The Mariners are going to go hitless the entire game. That's just sounds on. That sounds like Chad to me. There's a Packy Naughton to 199 for the Halos. That's going to be for Bobby. Wait, am I wrong? We need some regulars to step up here. And Where's Jimmy or Danny? They'll back me up. There's Thomas Eshelman for the O's. That'll be for Bobby B. And another Bobby for Bobby. Let's try to find some parallels for that. For him. For you. Of him. For you. Jaron Duran Duran, 60 out of 60 for Boston. Bobby with Boston. Hmm, I couldn't be more wrong. I see. Hmm. Interesting. Tanner's got the under on sixth innings. It's Connor Brogdon for Philadelphia. Debut signatures. Bobby with the Phillies. Last spot mojo. That's right, Rex. That is crazy. I mean, just, let's just dwell on that for a second. Aaron Judge turned down the Yankees offer, bet on himself, and then had one of the greatest MLB seasons of all time. Pretty crazy. Zach Short, autograph for Detroit. Zach with Zach. Zach with an H. Zach with a K. Uh, Zach, we looked up Zach Short's height, and he's about 5'10", 5'11". It's Trevor Rogers to 125. Now what are the Yankees going to do? They're, they're going to they're gonna try to improve on their offer in hopes that, that Aaron Judge... It's also a fan favorite. Doesn't go to some other team. Not much else they can do. Right? Yeah. I mean, he can go to. Uh, he can he can go to the Giants. He can go back home to the West Coast. There's Bryson Stott for Philadelphia. Also for Bobby. Another last spot mojo hit. <laughs> These are not rumors, Chad. This is this is a. Uh, this is you being in the chat throughout the baseball season. The, the fourth and final game tomorrow will be San Diego at New York Mets. That's the 5.07 game. It's you Darvish for the Padres versus Max Scherzer. Who does everyone have in that game? Tanner, has any of the top silver packs been good? Yes, the ones with the ones with the short prints in them have been pretty good. Those are few and far between. No. Chad's definitely not that. I will never accuse him of that. Far too passionate about his team. Chad, Chad loves me. Chad, he might love this, the city too much, Lucas.
There's Peyton Henry or Peton Henry. It's possible. I don't know how he pronounces his name. That goes to Miami. That'll be for Bobby. And Bobby also has the Royals. Bobby with Bobby. Royals cleaning house a little bit here. There's debut signatures. Uh, Oliver Ortega for Bobby B. Miguel Cabrera, Blue Mojo, 001 out of 199. First one ever printed. Here's Packy Naughton. Another one for the Halos. That's going to be for Bobby B. <laughs> and Chad, what are, what other Kyles do you hate? It seems to be a, some Kyle hatred here. There's Kyle Lewis. And another Zach Short for Zachary. Wow, Jason. Nineteen out of sixteen. That's savage. Bryson Stott, debut signatures. Bobby Bursky with the Phillies, last spot mojo. Final box, and then a double header coming up. Starbucks. Oh, you're right. The owner of the Starbucks shipped the Sonics to OKC. Okay. Yeah, Starbucks is I. Right. I think Starbucks nowadays is just there's just so many of them. It's just it's just like a convenient place to go. It says as ubiquitous as uh as Dunkin' Donuts. It's West Coast Dunkin' Donuts, right? All right. There's Julio Rodriguez. For Seattle. I'm looking forward to that Seattle Toronto matchup. Max Cranick to 199 for the Pirates. And Wander Franco. There's Ronzi Contreras. And speaking of Contreras, Rex wondering, what does everyone think of Wilson Contreras? Did the Cubs re-sign him, or does he go to the Cardinals? 
to to be maybe a not a like for like replacement, but I don't know if he goes to the Cardinals. I feel like some Cardinals fans have said they've got some young catching prospect coming up the rank. Maybe they just give him the shot. There's Spencer Strider, rookie autograph. Spencer Schrader might be your NL Rookie of the Year. Greg uh, with the Braves. Oh, are you watching that? Yeah. Oh, it's, I thought it auto-play. You can just leave it. It's just going to play back over. Can't do a break and try to watch Rings of Power at the same time. Cooper Criswell, rookie autograph for the Angels. What do you who do you consider basic, Gilo? People who don't collect? One out of twenty-five. People who don't collect, especially on jazbeescasebreaks.com, they're basic. There's Kyle Muller. And we got a three out of five, Kevin Smith. And that green, what, shockwave, shimmer, shock, something parallel. But it's out of five. It's a train whistle. It's for Toronto. That'll be for Rick, Rick T. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. And that, my friends, is that. Nice little break here. Uh, so a quick little recap. Thanks for watching, everybody. Prism uh, full case. Pick your team in the store right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Check it out. That'll break tomorrow. You can buy your spots tonight. Oh, yeah, there's that one of one. That was nice. It's got the Mike Trout lava flow. Woo. Pretty good stuff. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.